I had an incident that I felt the sharp pain and uh, had it checked out at the hospital. They had found that I had uh, Hodgkin's lymphoma. But I took it on as one of the projects that I normally take on around here. Medicines were all on a schedule, all on an Excel spreadsheet. As everybody says, if he hasn't got his brown book, then he's lost. And that's true. Family friends helped me pull through that. And when I say the family, I'm not only saying my family, but the extended family at work. Everybody helped. Everybody helped. Home away from home. I look at my job as a uh, facilitator. I'm there to help get that project going on schedule and within budget. The only thing that's going to be left in here are these four pieces of equipment. Everything else is changing. You can't do it alone, that's for sure, and you need a lot of people with a lot of talent to help you be successful in this. So everybody's uh, pitching in. You need to uh, trust them, and, and we all do. Listen to the people around you. That's the way They'll it is. You what I liked about the wheel is that it, it just showed a sense of a complete person in one. In my sense, I do every other part of this wheel on a daily basis. At least I hope I do, and that's no less than I expect of myself to be doing it. And we do want to get the equipment on the floor, but we want to get it on right. For me, doing the right thing means uh, the responsibility. I become an owner of that job, and I will do whatever I have to do to get it done, get it done as quickly and as efficiently as possible. We're trying to get into operational today. So and in part of that doing the right thing, the company, they knew that I couldn't travel, and that minimized my risk of uh, getting any complications. <laughs> After the six months, it's cancer-free. And one of the things that we got to do right is concentrate on <laughs>